Hey, it's Timmy O'Neill, and we are live from Summer Market 2014. How live? Alive and kicking. Loving life here because we bring all the people that are lovely, <laughs> wonderful, and deeply legendary. Speaking of which, we have Colin McPhillips and Mickey Munoz. Mickey, how are you? I'm doing great, thank Colin, you. Colin, how about yourself? I'm doing great also, thank you. <laughs> all right, cool. You guys come from the, the deeply legendary Southern California surf scene. We were just talking about that whole sense of uh, a limited capacity on the waves. Mickey, you've been surfing for quite a while. Uh, how has that whole scene of coming with more and more people coming into surfing? Are, are there just more legends coming in or more legions of people? <laughs> well, it's both, yeah. Um, you know, it's a, like you said, it's a limited resource, and uh, there there are more or more servers than waves. So yeah, there's a you know there's a hierarchy and there's a working around that problem. But you know what? I think it's getting better. I like I that. I think I think people are getting more aware and more. Um, I I wouldn't say generous necessarily. Not necessarily but, generous, but sharing is caring. There you go. Yeah. We love that. You got it. And Colin, with the whole advent <laughs> of Stand Up Paddle, because you guys both come uh, very deeply from the surfing world, mm -hmm. uh, where you're prones, then standing up. Stand Up Paddle, of course, huge proliferation in the last five or six years. How has that increased the numbers in the waves and in the water? Um, I mean, it's brought a lot more people out for sure, because it's such a fun thing to do. And I mean, it's a the learning curve. I mean, kind of anybody get out there and have a lot of fun on the water. But the, what it's also brought is you can roam around and catch waves by yourself. You could paddle down the beach where it might not be as good, but on the boards we're riding and with the paddle, you could have just as much fun at a B wave alone. And that's one of my favorite things to, that, that the sport brought to me is just to kind of roam around and find your own waves. It's kind of an adventure and surf by yourself. So as, as far as where you guys see stand up paddling going, I mean, it's really, sort of revitalize the surfing community. It's, we've never had surf inside the outdoor retail. I mean, we're landlocked in Utah right now, mm -hmm. but yet you see a dozens of stand-up paddleboard companies. Where do you see this thing going, Mickey, as far as the, the future of SUP and what's happening with it? You know, I don't think there is a limit. I, you know, every place there's water, you can enjoy it, and it's easy enough that anybody can do it. It's definitely healthy. My balance has gotten better, my core strength is better, and, and I think my attitude's better, so. I like that, you know, all around well-being, dude. It is. So as far as being here, calling an outdoor retailer, what is it about this building, being here at this show, that, that brings you the stoke? Um, I love it. I've, I've been coming for the last, you know, f what, four years here, and I love going up to Park City, Palo around lakes, going to rivers. It's so different from where I live, it's, it's in the mountains. So it's just a really neat experience, and I could still be in the water and play in the water, so I get the best of both worlds. Cool. Well, well, Mickey Munoz, a treat to have you here on the program. Yeah, thank Colin you. McPhillips, thanks thank so much for being here. Thank you. This is Timmy O'Neill signing off with Colin McPhillips and Mickey Munoz live from OR. <laughs>